Hi, morning to you laddies. My name is Assassin, and we are playing Midnight Scenes, The Nanny. This is the third game in the series, and, uh, yeah, let's just start new game. Um, if you didn't see last episode, uh, aliens taking over the planet, I think. I, I don't know, still, oh my god, it's a giant eye. <clears throat> is that the Eye of Sauron? Do I, do I click it? Oh, it's blinking at me. On tonight's episode, two innocent children will face their most primal fear, haunted by mysteries from beyond the grave. Ancient secrets that should never have been unearthed, tormented souls wandering between realms. Turn off the lights and enjoy the chilling tale. Again, tent, sun, window. But whatever, uh, you don't care, you're just stinky eyeball. Welcome to another dimension. Welcome to Midnight Scenes. Ooh! Spooky. And you like it? Midnight scenes. 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 <laughs> it just starts echoing. <laughs> Why does that look like the Halston from The Simpsons? October 1986. Was that the bite of- Playing with a toy action figure. <laughs> Good morning, my name's John Wilson. <laughs> Who are you? Good morning! I, I swear, every time I try and do a female voice in a video game, I just can't. I don't know why. I just- I fucking can't. Wait a second. I am John Wilson. What are you talking about? You must be- You must be a double. A double? Are you crazy? Double lists don't exist. Really? Then how do- How do you explain this? Oh no, you're a doppelganger, my evil double, aren't you? Are you here to kill me and steal my identity? I don't want to die so young. Ah! Are you coming to say goodbye to mom and dad? I'm busy. Uh, they're gonna, they're going to be away for three days, won't you miss them? What are you playing anyway? They're gonna be away for three days, won't you miss them? Why should I? They're leaving me alone with you, and that's silly Veronica for three days. I hate them. Veronica's nice, I like her. That's because you don't have any personality, you dumb beta bitch. <laughs> oh, you can choose both of them, okay. What are you playing anyway? I still can't believe they bought me another identical penny for my birthday. I wanted a Toyota Supra. <laughs> they don't care about me, me at all. They don't even remember which toys they already gave me. Uh, aren't you two Benny? Aren't two bennies better than one? Can I have one of them? Aren't two bennies better than one? Don't be silly, it's ridiculous. Can I have one? <laughs> no way, I'd rather keep playing this stupid doppelganger thing for the rest of my life. Well, aren't you a ray of sunshine, you bitch? I'm sorry, Tina, or what? Oh, I can actually walk. Don't worry, if anything comes up, I'll call you right away. <laughs> have a great trip, the bay is beautiful this time of year. Wish you were there. Or wish we were going for pleasure, not work. Oh my god, your kid's like right there. <laughs> we should go. The plane leaves in three hours, and we might not. Or and we might hit some traffic. Bye, kids. Be good, and don't push Ranga too hard. Bye, mom. Bye, dad. I'm gonna go talk to my bitch ass sister. 
Sorry. Brat. Well, I, here we are. We still have a couple hours until dinner time. Would you... What would you like to do? Uh, let's, what kind of kid wants to paint? I'm sorry, but when I was a kid, I just sat and watched TV. And I wasn't like, you know what? Grab me a canvas and some paint. I'm about to fucking... Fucking Squidward this shit. <laughs> Watch TV. Oh wait, no. Squidward played the clarinet. I don't know why I thought... His... No, wasn't he an artist as well? Oh, I don't fucking know. The amazing Jess... <laughs> Is this supposed to be like a play on to the amazing world of Gumball? But obviously they can't use that, so it's... The amazing Jesse is about to start. I love that show. Of course you do. You're a bitch. TV is entertainment for dumb kids. Honestly, she's really like pulling off that, um, what's I call it, vibe. That, uh, you know, the Jaden meme where it's like, I want, I'm tired of playing these stupid games. I want to talk about economics and politics. <laughs> she's that meme. Let's paint. Uh, let, yeah. I don't like to paint. Uh, I like to paint trucks that explode and. Your drawings are boring. You paint like a little baby bitch. That's not true. Tana, don't talk to your brother like that, you fucking whore. <laughs> it's Christina. Only my family caught. <laughs> oh my god. I've taken care of so many of you so many times. Don't you like consider me family yet? <sighs> Don't be ridiculous. You're just an ends to my villain arc, my anime backstory. Once I eliminate you, the only thing that will remain is my dumbass brother Oliver. Sorry, <clears throat> sorry, that was another uh, plot. Anyway. Well, Oliver, it looks like your sister is in a bad mood. She's like so being a bitch. Maybe she wants to tell us what to do. Let's go. Oh my god. Honestly, I'm not afraid to kick a child. Let's go to the forest. The forest? On the other side of the lake. Uh, yeah, it's super cool. We go there oh, some afternoons with mom and dad. It's very pretty. The trees are painted in the good. Uh, right, we can just choose both options, I think. Yeah, it's super cool. We can go there some afternoons with mom and dad. We cross the lake with the boat and have a picnic sometimes. Can we go, please? That way I can look for my toy truck. I lost it in the clearing the other day. Okay, fine, fucking Brad, just for an hour, and then we come back. Yay! You pick up the oars. Sure. Oh no, Veronica, you're gonna die. <laughs> I better not go into Tina's room if I want to stay alive. She actually has a machete, and a, a, funny enough, she knows how to bury a dead body. I haven't really questioned it at the time, but now I'm kind of concerned. Looking forward to the premiere of Galaxy of the Cats Part 2. Bro, let's go. Let's go. I want to see Galaxy of the Cats. Who else wants to see? Whoever wants to see Galaxy of the Cats, raise your hand. Me. Me. Jordan's trees are invading our garden. Sparkle hasn't come to eat in days. He's probably dead. Poor dog. Or Rio, uh, what's gonna call it? Tina, what's her name? No, Christina. Yeah. Probably murdered him. Oh no, I'm gonna get dragged into the lake by a killer with a machete. Do either of you know how to row? I've never piloted a boat. Leave it to, leave it to the professionals. But it's safe, right? I still need to get paid, you know. Don't be afraid, there are no monsters in the- no, that's what you think. Or anything like that. Just sit next to me and take my hand. Ugh, get in the boat, lovebirds. 
so, um, Veronica, I'm kind of, I know, I, I'm, you're like twice my age, probably, and, uh, you probably want to date me, but, like, I'm kind of, like, when you want to go on a date with me, Veronica, you, you see my dance moves, I'm good at dancing, see, see, the Billie Jean, not my love, okay, I'll get in the boat, I'll, or I'll look, whatever. Uh, yeah. Can I go look for my truck? It can't be very far. You're always losing stuff. You'll lose your stupid head one day. Because I'll cleave it from your shoulders. <laughs> okay, you can go, but don't walk too far. I don't need to be paid, and I can't have you die on me. I don't want to lose sight of you. People are so inconsiderate. I'm already being lured into the forest by... What was that, aliens? Chris, not Chris, Veronica, I found alien markings on a tree, even though you probably can't hear me. Is he not gonna question that there's just a bunch of crows with red eyes? Say if you count the rings, you can read their age. Yeah, that sounds like a lot of work for me. I'm sorry. We could give the rose to Veronica, though. Why didn't you take it? Oh. Prehistoric dinosaur. That yeah, goes well for that piece. Catch it. Eat it. Cook it. Aw, oh, get the little guy. What is it? Is he eating a cigarette? Why can I hear breathing in the mic as he- Oh god, I hate that. Uh, yeah, this is- this... Little Johnny... This bodes well for your future, I'm just saying... I... Mom never lets me play this far from the clearing. My truck must be around here some- but his kid's gonna die. I swear, kids never fucking listen. And that's one of the reasons I fucking hate them so much, because the parent will be like, don't go too far, and then the kid will be all being like, you know what, I'm gonna go in my own fucking dimension, and probably end up five states away. And then I'll turn around and be like, Mom? Oh, where are you? Like, you fucking dumb child. Maybe you deserve to die. Maybe... Sorry. Here you are. Who put you there? Oh, great. You got your truck back. You're gonna die. Wait, how the fuck did Tina in? She's gonna kill me. I fucking knew it. I knew I couldn't trust your bitch ass face from the stuff. So. Hey, Oliver. Come here. There's something on the Tina? Why did your voice change and everything? What are you doing here? I'm gonna murder me. Oh no. That ain't Tina, I just really <laughs> Cause if they're there, that means and at the start it was being like uh what's that called? Doppelgangers and shit. That's Tina's got double game. Oh my god, it makes sense! <gasps> We're gonna die! <laughs> so many squirrels in the forest. One time, they ate a kid from the town from head to toe. Jesus, you're amazing at parties. This is why you have no friends. This is why all the kids run away from you because they're afraid you're gonna murder them. Only his bones remain. I'm not lying, it was on the news. That's like creepy. By the way, where's your brother? I told him not to walk too far. Don't ask me, I'm not the babysitter. Oliver! I need to pay!
Oliver! What's wrong? What the hell is this? The forest is full of paintings like that. That says there's this magical ore from the tribes that live in the woods. It keeps the paintings bright. This one though, I haven't seen it before. It certainly looks recent. So creepy you didn't paint it to scare- So creepy you didn't paint it to scare passerbyers, did you? How would I have painted it? It's like 20 feet tall. I'd need a fucking ladder, you dumb bitch. Come on, it's time to go back. I don't like this place, it gives me the fucking creep. Come on, Oliver, let's go! Oliver? That ain't Oliver anymore. Oh. Oliver! What's what's happening? Is he alright? No idea, come on, help me get him to the boat. He's possessed or dead. I mean his eyes look really red, so I don't know. Thank God you're back. How are you feeling? My head hurts. My head hurts. Of course, you took a good fall, fucking idiot. Hey, are you sure you're okay? Maybe I should call a doctor. I don't know what that happened. have been in and out for about ten minutes. You scared us to death, and Tina, where is she? In her room, I think. I wonder what she wanted to show me. What do you mean? In the woods, she told me to follow her. I tried, but she walked too fast. Then I found that strange drawing on the rock. It really impressed you, huh? I, I don't know, I guess. Come on, rest while I heat up dinner. The lasagna I brought will surely bring you back to life. I'm like the bomb at fucking cooking. And if you don't eat my fucking lasagna, I swear to god I will shove that down your fucking throat and make you- Looks like dinner er, looks like dinner did wonders. I like how happy your face is- or rosy your face. Now, rest little prince, have sweet dreams. Don't listen to her. The demons inside my head, they speak to me. Don't listen. They will come and they will rip your soul from your corpse and pile your body up on ashes as you suffer from the eternal house. What? <laughs> Tina, she's always mean, but I think you're cool. Oh, thank you very much. I thought you were like crazy for a second. I was about to like call it exorcist or something. I think you're cool too. I really enjoyed taking care of you both, you know? And that sweet sweet paycheck is amazing. You're very interesting kids. Hey, do you want me to show you my collection of skeletons? And my ritual knives that I use to summon Satan? <laughs> it's from the Midnight Zombies TV series. <laughs> Midnight Zombies. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> sure, I'd love that. <laughs> game, is it you taking a shot at your own game being like, Hey, look at our new trading card. It's called Midnight Zombie. This, this one is the biggest and scariest zo- Oh wait, no, that's Oliver. <laughs> of the family, but he's always nice to- Nice to the living. Okay. Is one of them gonna be Satan? Don't be fooled. Even if, even though it's a baby, this one has a super sharp teeth. Another one. This one's the most evil. I call her Tina. She devours brains. Oh, uh, it's the doggy. Oh god, is this gonna be- is this gonna be us by the end of the game? 
There's gonna be a zombie dog, and then the zombie, and then I forgot the other cards. This one's my favorite. Isn't she cute? What a fantastic collection. I love it. Hope you don't dream of bringing zombies tonight, even though we're gonna be them. Ha <laughs> Get some rest, Oliver. Good night. Night. TTYL. Thank God I'm fucking rid of that kid. God. We're great back with the scary crows. Oh God, is the wind right? <laughs> Yeah, again, never really been a fan of art. Oliver, hey Oliver, are you awake? You wanna do some rituals? What do you want? Let me sleep! It's Veronica, she's gone. She probably left, we didn't pay her enough. She left us. She's downstairs, and here's the TV. Oh, oh yeah, why don't you go down there and check it out, you bitch? I'm telling you, I saw her from my window. She's walking toward the pier. She must be meeting her boyfriend secretly when she should be here taking care of us like that other time. You made it up. You never like Veronica. I didn't make it up that boyfriend of hers jumped over to our garden to be with her i saw them kissing yeah but this time i have my camera i'll take pictures come on let's see if we can spy on them from the window okay totally not creepy see something the boat is missing They've gone to the other side of the lake. How romantic. How? She doesn't know how to steer the boat. <laughs> Mark proves that she's with her boyfriend. I can see a light in the forest, but nothing more. Dad has the old binoculars in his office. Uh, and you want me to go get them, of course. I have to keep watching in case they come back. Come on, they must be on his desk or in his drawer, or maybe in the closet. <sighs> you know, bitch, I hate you. I mean, lovingly, sister. Dad would be mad if he found out I've been snooping around his office. Dad, there's something you're not telling me. That crow is staring. Oh, God. Also, is there gonna be like a, a thing, my Norse mythology, can't Odin like see like, people from crows? So is there gonna be like something like that? It's locked. Uh, find the key. I wonder if dad killed someone in the war. Maybe I'll ask him when he... Hey dad, you ever murdered someone? Huh? I ever just wrecked some... I don't know. Hello? This is... This is the Krusty Krab. No, this is Patrick! Who is this? This isn't the Krusty Krab. Veronica, please come back. Why'd you leave us? Is there gonna be a body in here? These are from when I was born. Anything weird in the back? <gasps> Wait. I was gonna say, isn't that from... What's what I call it? Uh... The first game, the highway. I don't know. Oh, I miss him. I miss her. She never would have left us. Here, 
Here they are. Someone's having mommy issues. <laughs> Why is it so squishy? <laughs> Dead secret is a condom. <laughs> And also, that's gross. What? I don't like any of this. Fuck did the music stop? And why was I on the screen? Tina? Don't be a demon. Okay. Finally, er, finally come back. Or er, finally come on. Give me the binoculars. No way. I got them. It's my turn to look. Nothing but crows. Kind of boring. Tina, this was useless after all. You woke me up for no reason whatsoever. Oh, never mind. I see Veronica. I see Veronica. Yeah, that's what I said. She's alone and looks confused. Hey, wait. She stole my flashlight. Come on, let's go. Come on, let's go to the pier. Maybe we can see what's going on from there. Can't leave her husband. No, you no, know, fuck it up. Okay, I'm not staying home alone. Great, get dressed and grab your walkie-talkie. We might need them in, ca in case we lose track of each other. But we're not going to, are we? Of course not. It's just precaution. Okay, I'll get my walkie-talkie. You fucking bitch. Okay. I have to walkie talkie. Great, let's go to the pier. Impossible to see anything from here. They've taken the boat to the other shore. We'll have to walk around the lake on all night. This is a terrible idea! I have a very bad feeling about this. Do you think I'm enjoying this? Of course you are! You're Satan herself! <laughs> I didn't do shit. Why does everything have to be done your way? Well, I don't like dragging along a whining, crying baby either. So, we both have to put up with this, however. Okay, I'm sorry. Sometimes you're not such a crybaby. I was expecting a hug, but What now? There's something floating in the water. Is that an arm? Looks like a bag. It's Veronica's bag. Are, are you sure? Yeah. Yes, yeah, see? It's the her pyro. The cat's face on it. It's hers. Did she drop it? We'll never reach her from here. Find me something to get it with. Okay. That work? Oh wait, I need that. Okay, I think I know what I gotta do. Here you gotta boom. Snip snip. Yes we do. I already have a thing. Okay, Christine Teen Teen Tina, whatever your name was. I got a brand. Yeah, yeah, that, that would work real well for you, dang. Tina, you fucking idiot! Are you okay? Hey, it's very cold. Something wrapped around my leg, I can't get out. Tina, what do I do? Okay. Hey, hey, calm down. Everything will be fine. Come on, throw me something to hold on to. Yes? This and this.
There. Now go find help. Prince Jordan is awake. I saw the light in her window. Come on, go. I'll be fine, don't worry. Just hurry up, okay? Here, take one to walkie talkie. That way I'll know you're okay. Thank you. And I gotta check the bot. I don't even know. Find help. Miss Jordan's help. Quick. I don't know where Miss Jordan is. Oh my god. How the fuck are you supposed to see that? It's like the littlest thing. Go to the street. Hello. I can't move. I hope she's okay. Hello? 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 Tina? Tina, are you still there? Yes, I'm freezing now. Have you found help? I want it. Like eight crows are eating a dead bird's blood. I hope that not sparkle. Oh, I found what happened to Sparkle. BGG. No, no, you don't. don't worry, Miss Jordan. I'm gonna dance, move off to your part or their apartment, house, whatever. Danny. Okay. Oh, Danny. Danny. What are you doing here? Is everything all right? Miss Jordan, I need help. Our babies are going to with us and your baby, but she's never going to looking for it. Uh, okay, okay, babe. I hate kids. Come on, that is cool. Slow down. What happened? Get him out of here, man. Oh my god, is she okay? Yes, but she can't get out of the water. She needs my help. And where are your parents? They're out. They left us with the babysitter. But she abandoned us. Okay, I'll run into the pier to help. Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh, I'm gonna die. Your sister. Sorry, the demons were speaking to me. They said you're gonna die. You stay here and attend Thomas in case he needs an agent. You know he requires special attention. He's in, he's in his room. Keep an eye on him, will you? Oh, I, I'll be right back. Oh, right. I feel bad. I feel like I just brought completely bad luck upon this entire family. I like the bubblegum color. It's so great. Hello, Thomas. Oh, poor Thomas. I even... What is he doing here? Tina's in trouble. Your mom went to take her. Really? I thought my mom was taking a bath upstairs. Sorry, sometimes my medication makes me confused. Yes, but she always ends up in trouble. I don't like him. She found the hanky can't get out. Seriously? Well, don't worry. Mommy's very strong. She'll pull her out of the water. She's like big strong bear. <laughs> come on, she'll or, yeah, come on, she'll be fine. I swear I don't. I thought my mom was shooting in the back. <laughs> I don't know what voice I'm giving. <laughs> I hate this medication. Ooh. How do you feel? Physically or mentally? Cause phys er, physically I feel stronger than ever! <laughs> mentally, I feel even stronger! I can't take two steps without gra gasping for air. Oh, <laughs> I feel so bad. I did not, I feel wonderful. Mentally? Well, it's been only two months since Dad died. Oh, for Tom. 
It's been hard, and Mom makes me go to therapy with a super boring lady. Can I ask you something? I never asked you before. You don't have to answer if you don't want to. Of course, ask away. About your illness. Are you gonna die soon? I'd be very lonely. You're my best friend at school. Yeah, no idea. <laughs> Mom always makes plans for the future. But I think she does it just to cheer me up. Her words are happy, but her face is sad. But I don't care too much about it. It's not afraid. I'm not afraid of dying. Really? I'll go back to the same dark, tr tranquil place where I, where I was born before I was. I like that idea. Jesus, this game took a turn. <laughs> Shit. Oh, my bad. Uh, you never told me how your father died. I, I don't know. Mom never talked about it. One day, he got a call from the doctor, and suddenly he stopped talking to us. He spent the rest of his days crying and sleeping. I'm sorry, I'm sure he loved you very much. I don't know. He changed a lot. Anyway, let's stop talking about sad things. Look, I want to show you something. It's super cool. Thomas? I feel bad for you. I really do. But you brought this out, and now I think you're a fucking idiot. Anytime someone brings out a Ouija board, it, bad things happen. Someone's gonna die. My friend named Mom closet. I think she uses it to talk to the to the dad. Come on, who do you want to contact? I hate this. Uh, I don't want to contact you. There's things I don't like. Come on, there must be someone you miss your grandparents. They're still alive. Really? How boring. <laughs> you know, it's really boring that your grandparents are alive and they're not dead yet. <laughs> that, that's fucking boring. I forgot your name. Uh... Sean. Okay, I want to contact my dog. My dog, Allie. Oops, Amy. Uh, my old nanny. You lived in this house before you moved in. She was great. She had one eye missing and one eye patch like a pirate. Oh, that's the person we saw in the picture. One day, she suddenly disappeared. Mom told us she went to live on her family's farm in Colorado. But Tina says she saw an ambulance and the police. We think something horrible happened to her. Mother lie, you know. They do it to protect us. They lie. We are going to contact your old babysitter. If she died in this house, our presence will be super strong. It'll be super cool, you'll see. I don't know. Come on, this is fun. Here, put your hand on this triangle thing. It's called a plan shit. Now, I'll add my hand that we join our energies. Now, close your eyes. Oh, my God. You have them closed? Yeah. Good enough. Focus on your videos. I found this picture of her in my father's office. Do you think it might help? Are you kidding me? It would help a lot. Let me see. It's super cool. She looks like a, like a pirate. This picture will attract her spirit. Come on, put it next to the board. I start. I don't know if I like this. Relax, we can stop whatever. That's what everyone says, and then they can't stop because the demon and the thing. We simply say goodbye to the spirit and we'll leave without a trace. Ready? 
I hate this. I hate this. Never play with an Ouija board. You're moving it. It's not me, it's your nanny spirit. Like, I don't care if it's for fun or whatever. Just leave those fucking things alone. You have a leak? The bathroom is right above us. And your mom left the tap running. Really? Your tap is running red? Don't get up, I'm gonna take a look. Uh, hello? Oh my god. Is that Miss Jordan? Oh my god. Miss Jordan, well, oh my. <laughs> Keen, are you there? That Miss Jordan is not the real Miss Jordan. Miss Jordan is dead. There's blood everywhere. Keen, do you hear me? I have to go to the here quickly. No, Miss Jordan. No, she was such a nice lady. Elder, what is it? I hear you screaming. It, it was the bathtub. It, your mom's dead. Oh no! His mom dead and he's all alone and he might die so oh, this is sad! His life just keeps getting worse and worse! You stay here and call the police. Do what I tell you. The, the police because of an open up. Just do it and tell the cops to come first. But Oliver, fucking shut up and do it, Oliver. That's the cool. I don't know why, but I feel safer outside than like that I do in my own house. And that's such a fucking scary thought. To feel safer outside than you do in your own house. Cause like, your whole house is supposed to be like a place where you feel the most safe. But now that I know that my house can kill me at any moment. Hey, it's Tina. Oh no, she's gone. Your footprint deemed to the path that borders the ah. Has Miss Jordan double taken Tina into the woods? But why? I have to go and find her. On the next episode of Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> I hear a bear. Hello, Tina. Tina, Veronica. My flashlight. Oh great. Easy, easy. I get closer, they'll find me. I have no nuts. I gotta find nuts. There has to be nuts somewhere. Oh wait. Can't. Uh they're not. Wait, let me try this. I I tried them before. I literally tried that before! Why are you working now? You literally see me in the video trying to give the fucking whatever. Give me the fucking flashlight. Everyone's probably dead anyway. Oh no, Tina, you're possessed by you. Tina, thank goodness I- that's not Tina. Are you okay? I thought I lost you forever. Come with me, Oliver. That's not Tina! Where are you going? Tina! 
That ain't her, man, you dumb bitch. If you thought, if you know that, I want to. What was that? Tina, where are you? If you thought Miss, uh, what's what I call it, had a double, and why don't you think, t there, you know, uh, I don't know, there might be other doubles? I fucking hate kids. They're so stupid. Veronica, oh my god! She's dead! What is happening? My little Oliver, it's time for bed. May I sing you a lullaby? You're not my mom. Don't worry, we'll find them. Even, even if we have to turn the world upside down. I've never, never seen anything like it. Two children kidnapped. The neighbor brutally murdered in her bathtub. The babysitter missing. Wait. Didn't we see, like, a thing? Two babysitters missing in one of the other games? Or, not two babysitters. Uh, two children missing in one of the other games? Under midnight scenes? Detective, we found Veronica T Turner, the babysitter in the woods. She's dead. Any on the Well, actually, there's something else, but you better see it with your own eyes. There's a dead body. I've seen plenty of those in my eyes. I'm a detective after all. God, poor girl. Look at her wounds. It's like a, a wild animal attack. A wild animal doesn't murder people in their bathtub or kidnap children, no. If you think that's strange, you haven't seen it all yet. Take a look at the rock. Why am I supposed to see him? Agent, point the light at the part. What the hell? They're a part of the painting now! Oh my god. Holy shit, that was really good. So... Okay. Poor Oliver. Poor Tina. We might never know what happened to them. But first, something tells me Detective Taylor won't rest until she finds an answer. For now, it's a secret between the two siblings and the creature in the forest. Thank you very much for enjoying this new chapter of the Night Symphony. Remember to shut your windows and lock your doors tonight before you go. Creatures of the night. Yeah, that was that was good. That was good. So, I wonder if that actually that actually what's what I call it adds more than to my theory than what I was gonna say. Okay. So I wonder if her the nanny or she the nanny other babysitter whatever if she is like the creature in the rock and. Either she wanted, she, she didn't want to be alone, or she was like looking for someone to like take care of, and so she was hoping that Oliver or Tina would find her. And now that she 
Oh, let's not call it. And now that they found her, like, they're with her, and they're with her together in the rock. But, uh, yeah, that was, uh, Midnight Scenes, The Nanny. Um, I don't know if there's gonna be more episodes. I'm hoping there is, because these are a ton of fun. And they're just, they're just, like, little, you know, games to chill, relax, and get a few scares out of. But, uh, I hope you guys did enjoy. Um, if you have any other game suggestions you'd like to see me play, leave them down in the comments section down below. And, uh, yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, don't forget to punch that like button in the face like a pirate. Also, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, and I will see you guys in the next video.